Oh, I like being in the fog region. I will brush the gallant region off. I've got sand between me toes, in me eyes and up me nose, and in me ear, too, and everywhere. <laughs> Derek. Yes. Uh, where are we exactly? The Sheik Elwan Seed's camp. Is he really? <laughs> He's a very hospitable chap, isn't he? That is what worries me, mon ami. Huh? The Sheik is the sworn enemy of France. I am puzzled why he treats us like the honored guests. I do not trust him. Well, he must be popular with some people. Look, he's got his own fan club. <laughs> <laughs> I say, Sheiky. Sheiky, old chap. That was a jolly nice dinner, but what's the catch? I'm most glad you asked that question, Effendi. You are welcome in my humble tent. But I regret I must demand a small recompense for the hospitality you received. I knew it. We've got to pay for our dinner. Uh, I'm sorry, cheeky old chap, uh, but they only pay us five francs a day and I'm skint. I have a feeling, Basil, that the Sheik does not want money from us. That is quite true. You have a most discerning comrade, Effendi. El Rancid, what do you want of us? A little information, my friend, in return for which I offer you the hospitality of my tent, plus a little pecuniary reward, shall we say? And if we don't give you this information? I fear the alternative is painful, but my men enjoy it. Perhaps they will pluck out your tongues with a red-hot pincer? Oh, or bury oh. you up to your necks in the sand and leave you to the scorpions? Ugh. Ugh. Nasty, creepy things. Ugh. Don't like scorpions. On the other hand, this most painful and unpleasant business can be avoided. If you tell me when your colonel will arrive with the relief column... Never, El Rancid. We do not betray our comrades no matter what you do to us. We die for La Belle France. We always fight for what is right. Deep in the heart of Texas. See him! <laughs> Take him away! No. And torture him till he talks! No, wait! Hang on a minute. Leave him alone, you rough riff. <laughs> you can't torture my comrade. I couldn't stand all that screaming. It would give me a shocking headache. I'll tell you when the relief column is coming. No, no, Bob Rush, do not be the traitor. Do not tell them. Silence, son of a camel! Go oh, all this blooming shouting. Oh. Come, speak. Well... This afternoon, I saw a letter from the colonel who had said that the regiment would not be arriving until my birthday. So, that is good. Release him, huh? set them loose. <laughs> With no water. Huh? The desert will take care of them, and we will take care of the regiment. <laughs> Aha, hey, hey. Stand back, come on, push on. It is the relief column. Legionnaire, you gave me your honor, they would not arrive until your birthday. Well, it's my birthday today, you silly old fool. All together, please. Happy birthday to me. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. <laughs>